Hi everybody! In this video we're going to, or I'm going to, be cutting my own hair. And not to worry, because I'm not gonna actually cut the length, I'm just gonna cut the tiny, or actually big ends, split ends, that I have. Because I haven't been to the hairdresser in probably half a year. And it's gotten pretty damaged, to be honest. I apologize for looking a little bit dead in this video. I couldn't really be bothered to do my makeup properly. I've been editing all day and I'm pretty tired. So I'm gonna go and make myself some matcha latte. And I'll come back and I'll show you how I'm gonna do this. Okay, so I now have my matcha ready. I have all my equipment that I'm gonna use. So let's just get started. So what you're going to need to cut your own hair is a comb, some hair scissors, preferably ones that look like this shape, and also a straightener if you don't already have super straight hair. Um, my hair is for the most part pretty straight. You can see it's a little bit wavy on this part, so I'm actually going to like um, straighten this, these parts and then just leave this because it's pretty straight already. So I know that when I go to the hairdresser, they always like make the this line, the hairline, like right in the middle. So it would be like there, just so that when they cut the hair and when they put it like on the sides like this, it'll be like equal length. So if I were to cut it right now, for example, I know that it would be longer on one side and shorter on the other side. So that would not be good. <laughs> okay, so let's make the line, the midline first. What do you call this in English? I I don't actually know. Okay, that didn't really help. I have a mirror right in front of me, so I'm just like looking at it. Be in the middle of my nose, right? So like it would be there. Da, 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 da. I mean, it doesn't have to be perfect, obviously. Like, they don't do it perfectly either. It just has to kind of be in the middle. I used to live in England and my, my English was really good then. Um, you know, relative to living in Bristol. When I went to Sweden, it just kind of went downhill from there. <laughs> Because I started speaking more Swedish and much less English. I still read in English though, so I think that really helps. Okay, this is gonna have to do right now. So what I'm going to do now is that I'm gonna put up the hair that's layered, which is basically like my bang parts and all the way here. But it's basically the hair that isn't as long as the rest, like this. <laughs> um, so we're just gonna put that up somehow. I didn't think this through, maybe. It's funny because I know that a lot of people are doing this at home right now because in some countries you can't really go to the hairdresser right now. I actually can, I just don't want to spend money. Is it bad to say that I'm unemployed on the internet? I don't know. Okay, so now that we have the bun up, this is the fun part, I guess. So what I've seen from videos is that depending on how thick your hair is, obviously my hair is pretty thick, I'd say. You put, um, you you layer it, just for cutting it, you know? And so I'm gonna take the the part that's closest to my neck first, like with the back of my neck. As you can see, it's like, the, the ends are so freaking bad. And um, to be honest, I probably would have to cut it much, much shorter than I want to right now. Um, but basically, the idea is that you just go like layer by layer. And eventually you'll do all the hair. So I'm gonna start with this hair and then gradually take more pieces from the back. Now's probably the time to use these. <laughs> so what I wanna do is that I wanna cut about this much, but I'm probably gonna start cutting like, like this much. Okay. Oh my god, why is this so scary? Let's try like a little, little bit first. I'm just cutting it straight off because I really don't want to thin out my hair. There you go, you got a nice view of my boobs. You know, this isn't so bad actually. I think like if I had shorter hair, it would be harder to do this. I get the urge to kind of cut a way more than I should, so that's not good at all. That's kind of dangerous. So it's always better to cut um, a shorter piece first, and because if you change your mind, you can't grow hair back that fast, so you have to wait. 
Okay, so that looks a little bit better than it did before. So as you can tell, this part of my hair always is so freaking dry and damaged and frizzy and I don't know what to do about it because the rest of my hair doesn't look like this. The hairdressers always look at this hair and they're like, uh, you know. But I honestly don't know what to do about it. Like, the only thing would ha have to be like cut it super short or something. Okay, so I know this is kind of funny because you can see the camera in the mirror, but this might be the only way that we can still see me. She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up I always hate it when my hair ends before my boobs because it's like, you know, if I'm walking like naked or if I'm walking with a cleavage or something it's like really hard to cover it up I don't know, does anyone else think about that? It's kind of a weird thing to think maybe she got the posture of a superstar She looks so fly in those Gucci slides Yeah, yeah, I wonder where she hides under her disguise yeah, yeah. I guess also, worst case scenario If I manage to fuck it up somehow I can always just go to the hair, hair little app I can always just go to the hairdresser Hopefully not, because that would defeat the purpose of cutting my own hair We'll never know She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something about her features You'll find her beauty goes much deeper Once you get to meet her She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something about her features It already feels like so different because now I can actually pull my hair through my... I mean, I can finally pull my hand through my hair. Damn, look at this. It never falls like that when it's dry and damaged. But now you can actually see. Like, you can see the end, you know? Like, before it was kind of like so thin that the thin parts were just kind of like strands. can match that Louis V scarf or I'm chilling with a dad. Whoa. Slow it down like that. Just hold me down like that. Yeah. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. I can't believe I let it take that long to cut my hair. You find the beauty goes much deeper once you get to me. She's a Mona Lisa. As you can see, I've cut this part of my hair and immediately it looks so much thicker. It this always happens. But I'm really scared that I've cut it too much and that I've cut it crooked. I mean, it looks pretty okay. It looks pretty decent when I look at it in the camera and when I look at it in the mirror. But you never actually know until you see it from the back. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. Okay, so we're just gonna cut the side pieces now. And now what I'm going to be doing is that I'm gonna take just like. Actually, I might straighten this hair first so we can see properly. Be back in a sec. Okay, so I'm back and I look really funny. And we're going to cut the side parts. But that's okay, it doesn't have to be super even. This part doesn't really have to be super even, just so you know. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something that features. You'll find the beauty goes much deeper once you get to meet her. Hey, let me paint a picture. I see they don't understand. Feeling like a so she brushing against my hands See you from around the way You didn't give me the time of day You be making moves that yeah Who really care what Simon say All the bad things, girl, I had to look past that Call yourself a dime, I'm just trying to get my cash back You be looking fine, so no one 
Honda, they can match that Louis V scarf for I'm chillin' with a dad hat, whoa Slow it down like that Just hold me down like that Just I guess the thing with like all artsy stuff, right? Like with a painting or um, a dance choreography or like a music piece. It's never really done. And we are going to look ourselves in the mirror and <laughs> what have I done? I mean, it's like a, it's kind of like a V shape, which is not too bad, I guess. It's definitely a V, or more like a, not really a V, more, like, more of a U, I would say. Actually, I think it turned out okay. Um, I was a little bit scared of how this was gonna go, but I can say that I managed to cut my hair properly, and I'm, wow, I'm surprised. Hope you enjoyed this video of me just cutting my hair a little bit. I really don't know what to say at the end of the video, so I'm just gonna say bye. <laughs> She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her